In a historic showdown at the US Open, Italy's Janik Sinner defeated American Taylor Fritz in straight sets on Sunday, marking his first ever US Open title and the first time an Italian man has won the prestigious tournament. Sinner, the world's number one, triumphed 6-3, 6-4, send 5 in what was also the debut final appearance for both players at the US Open. The 23-year-old Italian star secured his second Grand Slam title of the year following his Australian Open victory in January. However, Sinner's stellar season was clouded by a doping controversy involving a positive test for the banned substance, Clusterball. Sinner explained that the substance was inadvertently transferred to him after a trainer treated his physiotherapist but the incident resulted in deductions rather than a ban. Despite the criticism surrounding the doping saga, Sinner was unwavering in his performance. After the match, he shared, I was just happy to compete while clutching the championship trophy. He also expressed relief, stating, They know what happened and I haven't done anything wrong. Sinner received overwhelming support from the crowd at the packed Arthur Ashe Stadium, where this year's US Open was the most attended in history with over 1 million fans. They gave me so much energy, especially in moments when I was struggling, Sinner said. The star studded audience included celebrities like Taylor Swift, Travis Kelsey, Olympian Noah Lyles, and Martha Stewart, among others. For Fritz, Sunday's loss followed his All-American semi-final win against Francis Tifo. He was the first American man to reach a Grand Slam final since Andy Roddick's 2009 Wimbledon appearance, though Roddick remains the last US man to win the US Open title in 2003. In his post-match interview, Fritz reflected on his loss, calling it a really tough match and acknowledging Sinner as the world's best player. Visibly emotional, Fritz added, I feel like I almost let a lot of people down as he discussed the immense pressure leading to the final. Well, that's it for now. With this information, we wrap up today's story. Please stay tuned to US Most Red and please consider hitting the subscribe button. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.